Are four candidates running for the school board in Williamson County trying to oust the superintendent? That was the subject of a hastily called news conference this afternoon. Chris Conti is live at Centennial High School where those candidates briefly spoke. Chris. And Vicki, this is the kind of mudslinging you typically see in other kinds of races, not school board races. There are six seats currently open on the Williamson County School Board. Dr. Beth Burgos is vying for one of those open seats right now. She has emails that allegedly were leaked to the Tennessean earlier this week that apparently link her to a possible plan to oust the superintendent here. We acknowledge that there have been numerous emails sent out that we have been copied on. We cannot control what other people write or even the emails that they send to us or what might be said in those emails. Why are we standing in front of the high school if you don't even have kids that go here? <laughs> Said we're not taking questions today. Well, We've already been treated poorly by the press. Uh, we love you, sort of, but we don't want to be sucked in to any sort of more antics. But okay? you can't have That's a press enough. conference and not answer questions. It's a press statement. That was it today. No questions. Those four candidates just left as soon as they said what they wanted to say. No mention of what they plan to do if they get elected here in Williamson County. The school system obviously is a hot button issue here in the county as it's one of the highest performing districts in the state. Or earlier today, we spoke with Eric Welsh, who actually holds the seat that Dr. Burgos is vying for. Here is his take on all of this. I think our, our parents are wise enough to know what to really focus on and, and not get uh, uh, distracted too much by all this extraneous noise. They know what matters, and that's our, our students and our schools. Voting in this now highly contested race wraps up on August 7th. We are live in Williamson County this evening. Chris Conti, News Channel 5 HD.